I'll give you guys a quick guess at what this is. If we look on the side, you'll see who it's from. Boom, that is Shiitake 3790. Um, and this is the first time I believe I've seen it in New Zealand. I'm not sure if any other commercial um, growers use it, but I've never seen it for sale here. So finally, it's here and I can grow it. Big shout out to Fungi Ali for um, coming through for this. Um, I'm not sure if they've, in fact I'd say they haven't exported to New Zealand before, but there's a few hopes they have to jump through at their end, um, because of course because I um, had to get a permit to import the live culture here to New Zealand, and um, they jumped through those hoops nicely and got this culture to me. So um, I've just got a shoot out now, but as soon as I get back, we'll be looking at moving that culture onto a bunch of plates, and um, getting that into storage and getting that um, into some grain spawn as soon as possible so I can start using it. Let's just turn that off so we've got a bit of uh, silence in here. So it's Friday night, it's about 8pm I think, and I'm um, spending my exciting evening opening up my new shiitake uh, culture. So pretty excited about this. So I'm gonna get the camera down. We're gonna open this up. We're gonna get. I'll open it up, get it out. I'll show you guys, and then we'll get that culture spread across a bunch of plates. Um, and then after that, I've actually got my pressure cooker blow me down here, which I'm gonna um, inoculate some bags with. So we'll get this open now, and we'll give you guys a look. So normally I'd have my flow hood on, but um, but I don't at the moment just because it's horribly loud. So we're just we're just going to open this box, so so it should be alright. Um, the box is all contaminated, so I'll turn it on once we get this box out of the way. Just cross off my name, see so you guys can't uh, zoom enhance it. That's our package there. So this box can go outside. This funky alley sticker. That will go somewhere. And we have my uh, receipts. And my permit. I have to get a permit through our local import, uh, the Ministry of Primary Industries, which is um, so I could import uh, cultures into New Zealand. So that funky alley sticker is going to go somewhere. So obviously I don't know this how sterile the area was when they packaged this, so um, I'm gonna assume it was a, a non-sterile area. But um, I'll just make sure my hands and whatnot are clean. Here we go. Here's our plate. That's what we want to see. That's what I waited so long to get. So I, um, I've imported a few strains into New Zealand. Um, I should have ideally done the strain 3790 earlier on, but I didn't for some reason. Um, thinking back now, you know, Captain Hindsight's great. But um, I have it now, I've got a pile of other shiitake strains. But um, we're going to start growing this one and see how it performs. So we'll get my flow hood on now. And, um, and then I'm going to give this a wipe down with the alcohol. 
I'll get the camera off because um, the flow hood makes a horrendous sound and um, I'm going to transfer this to another bunch of dishes um, and get them um, in my incubation room to um, grow out of it. So there we have it. I think I've got 10 dishes there of my new shiitake strain from the um, original dis, uh, dish I was provided. You'll notice on there I actually write, I've written P1 and P2 on there. That is incorrect. Um, I've just written P1 on this because that's the, I don't actually know what generation that is, but that's the first generation I know of. So I'll record everyone from here down with a P2 star, that's the second generation of it. And then when I take a cutting from the mushroom and regrow off that, that'll be my, uh, my, become my new mother culture and that'll become the original P1. So the star on the, on the, on the, behind the P2 just annotates that it's incorrect, but for my own keeping, if I was to, t to take, to turn that plate into eight more plates, that would become P3 star to tell me that it's not actually P3 but it's the third down from this being the first of course so um, yeah happy about that so we'll get that into my little um, my incubation space for my plates and we'll incubate from those for a few days and we'll see how see how they grow out and we have found a little spot for the sticker on the blower of my flow hood so that can just sit there and stare at me every time I work thanks again Fungi Ellie.